I'm Megan Stouter and I'm here to show you our 2022 Country Star 3709. This is going to be one of our entry level diesel coaches. It's going to be one of our most affordable coaches, which is great for anyone that is looking to upgrade from a gas coach into a diesel. It's also going to be a shorter diesel instead of going to one of our um, 40 footers. And then along with that, it's going to be great for anyone that's a family or a couple. To start off here, our Country Star. You're going to see our chrome badge plate up front with our Newmar down below. This front cab area is going to be where you find your eight kilowatt generator. You're gonna have our bonded windshield. So our competitors, there's gonna be a gap here, but our windshield's gonna be bonded, which gives you a little bit more of an automobile kind of feel. You're also gonna receive comfort drive steering on this coach, along with it being built on our star foundation. The door side of our Country Star 3709, you're gonna have your side mirrors, which is gonna have auto defrost. You're also gonna have your side cameras located on the sides here. You're gonna have your entry door with an entry door assist handle. So whether you're coming in or out of the coach, we're trying to mitigate any type of um, falling or anything like that. Right here, you're gonna see a number. It's gonna say 3709, which is what I continue to say in this video. 37 is gonna stand for the length of the coach and 09 is gonna be the actual floor plan. What you're gonna see here on this coach is going to be one of our standard graphics. So you're gonna see the Ashbury behind me. You can go ahead and choose the Ashbury, the Roca, or the Foundry. But you're gonna see a really nice mix of some greens, some light whites, and some tans. So it's gonna be really eye-catching going down the road for you. Something you'll hear me talk about throughout our videos is gonna be our standards, our options, our specials. So a lot of times people, if they choose to not go the standard uh, graphic route, they can actually go ahead and special that in. Here at Newmar, we're here to help you in custom design as well as our dealers. Staying focused on the door side here, you're gonna see our awnings up top. So what comes standard with our Country Star is going to be our carefree awning package and that's also going to come with a LumaGuard. So the LumaGuard is going to come out with your awning and it's essentially going to protect the awnings from the sun's UV rays and any kind of damage from any tree branches when you're parked underneath the campground. Working down the door side of our Country Star here, you're going to see this little door here. So this is going to be where your diesel fuel tank is. This is going to be double sided so no matter which way you go into the truck stop, you can fill in from both sides, which kind of mitigates anyone that's gonna be angry with you because you have to turn around. Moving into bay one here, you're gonna open up this first storage bay. So this is gonna be a nice storage area. So you're gonna have insulated floor decking along with our insulated sidewall here. So this is gonna be our bead foam. And what you see featured here on the sidewall um, is also going to be within the floor decking underneath. Bay two, you're gonna see a full pass-through bay here. So again, that's gonna have that floor decking that's insulated along with the sidewall there. And I'm gonna go ahead and point out this diagonal truss right here. So I'll let our cameraman get in there. We'll point that out and I'll talk over it. So as you see here, you're gonna see this diagonal truss here. So that is going to be part of our STAR foundation. So that stands for strong, true, and robust. All of our star foundations are built upon our chassis. So this country star is gonna be exclusively on our Freightliner 360 horsepower chassis, but we're gonna build that star foundation, which is a Newmar exclusive super steel uh, superstructure here at Newmar. So one of our engineers, Ron Stichter, went ahead and came up with this. And this essentially just brings in the strength and durability of the coach and keeps the integrity intact all throughout. Along with that, it takes everything on the outside, the movements, um, any of the noise that you're going down the road with, it's gonna take everything and move it to the center of the coach, which provides you a quieter and smoother and more stable of a ride. And right above here over Bay 2, you're gonna see a exterior entertainment system. So this does not come standard on the Country Star, but it is an option available to you. So what you're gonna see here is going to be a 43 inch Samsung TV along with a Bose sound bar. Over here, you're gonna see a switch. So you're gonna have the Bose switch over here. So currently it's gonna be off, but you're gonna have the option to do the TV. So whatever is playing over here on the TV, you can play the sound through the Bose sound bar. And if you're playing music on the inside over the dash radio, you have a home mode where you can go ahead and click that. And basically this will connect to the dash. So whatever song's playing inside, it'll play throughout this Bose sound bar. And right up here on this wall, you're also gonna have two USB outlets along with a 110 volt outlet as well. 
Moving here into bay three, you're gonna have another full pass through bay. So again, you're gonna have that insulated sidewall, the insulated basement floor. Along with that, you'll see our road back here. So that's going to be our central vac system. So if you choose to option that in, all of that dirt and grime is gonna come out to your bay three and this is where you're gonna clean that out. Bay four here, you're gonna have a nice pegboard. So my mother-in-law and what you've heard in probably some of my other videos, she actually puts her arts and crafts in here. So she'll just get some wires and she'll basically make little cups for any of her pens or her crafts or any of her jewelry that she likes to make on the road. Here in bay five, you're just gonna have a smaller compartment. This might be good for anything that's a little bit taller. And bay six here, you're just gonna have your chassis battery. So you're not gonna have a lot to do with this, but this is where they're at. Along with that, you can go ahead and see behind me, you're gonna have a secondary egress door. So this doesn't come standard, but it's an option available to you. So I'll demonstrate it once we're inside, but this egress door is actually gonna have a um, extendable ladder as well. So this is gonna be reusable as well to you. as. And as we make our way to the rear of this Country Star 3709, what you're gonna see back here first and foremost is gonna be your rear radiator. Along with that, you're gonna see your tow hitch and you're also gonna see your brake sink down here which comes exclusively on your Freightliner chassis. You're gonna see your Ashbury graphics on the back here. You're gonna see your Chrome, Country Star, and Newmar badge plate. Along with that at the very top, you're gonna go ahead and see your rear camera. And then something that comes standard is gonna be a rear ladder which has access to your roof. And as we make our way to the off door side of this Country Star 3709, what you're gonna see first is gonna be our Truma AquaGhost. So this is gonna be a premium heating system for your water tanks. So essentially what they like to kind of say is always hot, always ready. Basically what that does for you is it prevents scalding. You're gonna have constant hot water throughout and it's gonna pump more liters per minute into your coach than what comes standard on this Country Star. Moving into our bays here. You're gonna just have a nice open bay here. So anything that might be a little bit thinner and longer is great for this. You're also going to have our bead foam sidewalls. Again, that bead foam insulated floor decking. And you're going to have lights that come on throughout the coach in your bay. And moving into the next bay here, you're going to have your rewind reel here. So this is what you're going to um, hook up to the campsite when you're parked and ready to go. So it's going to be a 50 amp cord for you. It's going to be a manual reel, so you're going to have to wheel that back in for you. But what you're going to see down here is going to be these rubber flaps. So essentially when you have that out, you can go ahead and shove that into those flaps and close the door nice and comfortably and you don't have to leave that open. And then to your next bay here, you're just gonna have your def tank pretty much to the point, but you're still gonna have that insulated uh, side door there as well. This is gonna be your waterworks system. So what you're gonna see here is you're gonna see a really nice clean look. It's gonna be that stainless steel frame on the front. You're gonna have your outdoor shower here. So let's say you've been hiking or you've been outside and you don't wanna take that dirt and grime inside. You can go ahead and just use that. You have your hot and cold here, your low point drains, your water pump, your fresh water tank fill valve is here, your sewage rinse. You're gonna have your um, supply water here for city water and your connection. And then what you're gonna see here is this tube. So when you see that that is pink, that means that this coach has been winterized for you. right next door you're gonna have a full pass through bay here so again ample storage ample space for you and I'm gonna keep these open so you can see both but again these are gonna be that full pass through bay so you can see all the way through to the next side and use it as your wheel so anything that's bigger or longer you can use those And here you're gonna have your LP tank along with your eight house batteries. This is gonna be your other diesel fuel tank here. And then here you're gonna have your electrical panel. And now we're gonna go ahead and explore the interior of this Country Star 3709. So starting out here, we're gonna start in our front of the coach in our cockpit area. We're gonna spend probably a lot of your time down the road. First and foremost, you're gonna see our driver and passenger seats. They are gonna be powered. They're also gonna be our Villa Comfort Fit furniture. 
Along with that, I said they're gonna be powered, but this passenger is also gonna have a footrest for your enjoyment. Over here, you're gonna have a couple of uh, buttons here. So you're gonna have your battery disconnect button here. You're also gonna have your um, patio and map lights, and then you're also gonna have your step cover here. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. I won't bring this out all the way, but this is gonna come out and it's then gonna come up and that's gonna be a flush top. That way you can step on this when you're sitting here as a passenger. Along with that, you're gonna have another assist handle here on my left and another one on my right. So no matter as you're coming in or out, you're not gonna be able to fall. Moving here, you're gonna see our nice gray toned dash here. And something you can option in in front here is gonna be your Excite Radio and Nav and Go system. So that takes away the Rand McNally, which we've had in the past years. Your Nav and Go system is something that you can go in and manually input your coach's dimensions. And basically what that does is that will then output a route that is best suited for you and your coach and your comfortabilities. If you want to explore this a little bit further, kind of dive deeper into the radio, the menu, how the navigation and maybe the cameras work, you can go and check out our infotainment video that we did a couple of weeks ago. Along with that, you're gonna have a nice charging port up here that's gonna be wireless for you. You're also gonna have your USB and a 12 volt outlet here. You're also gonna have your climate controls. You're gonna have your generator start up here up front. Along with that, you're gonna have your um, parking brake and then you're also going to have your driving shaft. So on our Freightliner chassis, they're going to be right here on the steering wheel. And then our Spartans are actually going to be on the left side of the driver. Right here in front of your steering wheel, you're also going to see your digital dash, giving it a nice clean look. Over here, you're going to have your cup holders, again, some climate controls and your lights. You're also going to have your equalizer systems, which is going to be our smart leveling jacks. And then right here next to your driver, you're also gonna have a opening window. So you can go ahead and move this down. So this will be in lock position. We'll go ahead and move it down. And then you, this can open so you can keep all the bugs out and keep the screen here. Or if you want both, especially if you're going through a drive-through or something, you can have both open for you. And then just simply close and lock that back into place. Staying focused up here, you're also gonna have JBL Premium Audio throughout. So you're gonna have a speaker over here on your um, left hand side and then a speaker over here on your right hand side and that's just going to give you ample sound throughout you can test that out with your radio along with that you're going to have owner support so with your country star you're going to get a specific brand specialist and he or she will be available 24 7 available to you um, if they you know go home on the weekends it might be somebody else that answers for you but if it's 2 a.m or 2 in the afternoon you can go ahead and give that a call and they'll help you with any service questions or any technical issues you might be having and then right above your driver, you're gonna have this cabinet here. So this might look a little overwhelming, but you're gonna become very familiar with it. So first and foremost, you're gonna have your off door side slide outs and your door side slide outs. You're gonna have your power control system panel here, your awning controls. So you're gonna have your on and off or the retract and extend. You're also gonna have security lights, your ex exterior step here. You're gonna have the awning in or out, awning lights. And then as we mentioned outside, you're gonna have that Truma Aqua Go right here as well. If you choose, you can option in a 32 inch Samsung TV in your overhead cabinets. This does not come standard, but you can option it in. Again, that's gonna be 32 inch Samsung TV. And if you don't option this in, it's just gonna be additional storage up here for you. And then you're also gonna have cabinets behind me. And that pretty much rounds out the front of the coach. And this is where you're really going to see where Country Star meets luxury. So within here, you're going to see a fireplace to the left of me, and you're going to see theater seating to the right of me. Both of these are going to be optioned in, so they don't come standard. Specifically over here, if you don't choose to option in this fireplace, you can actually have additional storage space here. But when you do option in the fireplace, that doesn't take away from your cabinets on the sides. So you're going to have three different shelves in here. Your fireplace does put off some heat here, so you can have high and low settings. You can also change the temperature again. You can change the lights on here, so if you want different colors, you can change that to whatever you want. It's just a nice thing to add into your coach and add a little bit of luxury to it. Right above here, you're gonna see this little nip here. So that's gonna be your televator. So I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate that for you. It's gonna be featured over here on your right-hand side here. 
So simply just click up, you don't have to hold it, and that televator is going to come up for you. As this televator comes up, you're going to have the opening window behind it with your balances. Along with that, you're going to have two 110 volt outlets over here. And as this comes up, it's going to be a 50 inch Samsung TV with a Bose soundbar. And right about below it, you're going to see this glass cabinet. So this is going to have a glass front so it can reach all of the signal within the coach because this is where your AV cabinet is going to be. So it's going to be pre-wired HDMI cords. So if you want to hook up a DVD player or maybe an Xbox, you can do so. And then over here on your theater seating, so as I said, these were optioned in. So what comes standard is going to be a 74 inch jackknife sofa. But if you choose to option these in, you can have the USB ports on both sides. Along with that, they're going to go ahead and be powered. So you can just go ahead and click these out. You have a nice footrest that comes up. You're going to have stainless steel cup holders to your right. And then you're also going to have a opening centerpiece. So within here, you're going to have a storage space. So you're going to have shelves and you're going to have a really deep area. Making our way into the kitchen of this Country Star 3709, what you're going to see first and foremost, and what I've kind of touched on already, are going to be these really pretty cabinets. So what is optioned into this coach is going to be our glacier glazed maple matte finish cabinets. So when we open these up, what you're going to see here is you're going to see our cabinets are going to be screwed and glued. So they're not going to be stapled, they're not going to be cheap, and they're all going to be made here in-house. So Newmark here prides ourselves on the little things, because the little things make the big things. So when you go into our coaches, you can tug on these things, you can move them around, and they're not going to fall off. They're going to be very dependable. And I almost challenge you to go into some of our competitors, do the same thing. You'll see the difference in what they do with how they manufacture their cabinet. Along with that, you're going to see our solid surface countertops. And matching that, you're going to have our solid surface black splash here. So this is going to be cut and made here in-house in Newmar. Again, it just gives it that extra touch of Newmar, extra touch of love here. Right over here, you're going to have a three burner Elite Series cooktop. So this is going to fold up and down for you. So you're going to have that. And then you're going to have ample drawers underneath. And then in this drawer, you're going to find a, another flush top. So this is going to match the one that's already out. And these are going to go ahead and flush over your sink here. So you're going to have a double stainless steel sink. So these are going to be able to be retractable. So you can put them back on for just additional counter space. And it just gives it a nice clean look, especially when you're going down the road. You're going to have your stainless steel faucet here. And then you're going to have another storage underneath with your trash can. And something I want to point out is within our coach, you're going to have our soft closed drawers. So you can open this up and you can slam it and it's going to catch itself. And then directly across from your kitchen here, you're going to have our optioned in Euro booth dinette. So this is not a sleeper, but it's going to be extendable. It's going to come with two leaves and it's going to have two folding chairs for additional guests. So you're just going to have to pull this out. It's going to come all the way out until you hear that click. You're gonna have two leaves that you can put in here and then two folding chairs. And again, this can sit anywhere from two to six people very comfortably. What comes standard is going to be a regular booth dinette that is a sleeper, but you can option in the Euro booth for additional space if you'd like. What you're gonna see here behind me, it's gonna be a nice opening dinette window. You're gonna have your balance, your light switches, and then you're also gonna have a 110 volt outlet along with two USB ports as well. And then right here, you're gonna see down the length of the coach is going to be our full slide out. So it's gonna be our full wall slide out. And what you're gonna see here is you're gonna go from the floor to the slide out here and that's gonna be carpet. So what's optioned in for the flooring is gonna be our vinyl plank flooring in lieu of the standard vinyl tile. They just did that for the coach. Gives it a nice little um, luxury upgrade. But again, you're going to go from the vinyl plank or vinyl tile to the carpet and the full wall slide out. And then directly next to your Eurobooth dinette is going to be the optioned in Whirlpool residential fridge here. So you're going to have a water dispenser on your front here. You're going to have your lock and lock underneath. This is going to open up. It's going to have ample storage and space, plenty of drawers. And then you're also going to have your freezer underneath with a ice maker as well. 
And then speaking of our Whirlpool appliances, what comes standard in this coach is actually gonna be a Whirlpool microwave as well. So moving back into our kitchen here, you're gonna have your Whirlpool microwave. It's gonna open up, you're gonna have a ton of space. And something that I've heard before is people actually make bacon, they make cookies, and they make bread in here. So just play with it, get used to it, um, see what you can and can't do and what you're comfortable with. And then directly above your Whirlpool microwave is going to be your fantastic vent. And what that does is whether you're making baking or something a little sneaky throughout the coach, this is basically just gonna be a vent. It's gonna take it throughout. But what I wanna point out here is when this is open, if it senses any rain or anything like that, even if it's open, it's gonna mitigate any rain from coming into the coach. And a highlight of this is going to be this cover underneath. So most of our competitors actually just leave that open. It can look a little jankety. But what we do is we match it to our featured designer ceilings up here, which you're gonna see throughout all of our Numar brands. Along with that, it's gonna match your cabinets throughout. So it's gonna be that Glacier Glaze Maple Matte Finish Cabinet. And this Country Star 3709 is gonna be a full bath with a partial midship bath here. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up with the hinged door. And what this does is it allows you to get in and out of the bathroom when you're going down the road and your slides are in. This is actually going to be a um, idea from Numar. So our guys here in Numar engineered this in, which is gonna be really cool. And we can go ahead and take a peek inside. So right here, you're gonna have your commode. You're gonna have a vented window with cabinets above. Along with that, you're gonna have a, another vent and fan up top. Over here, you're gonna see, again, ample storage space. You're gonna have a Corian bowl with a medicine cabinet above. You're gonna have your stainless steel faucet with that um, solid surface countertop and backsplash here. You're also gonna have two 110 volt outlets with your ceiling lights here and that fantastic vent um, button here. And then this is where your central back system is gonna be located. So as we pointed out in the bay over here on your door side, when you're going and you're dusting or you're vacuuming anything throughout your coach, that's where your dust and grime is going to go. So you're going to vacuum that in, it'll suck it up and take it out to that bay and it's going to be really easy to clean up. And I'm going to go ahead and welcome you into our master bedroom here of our Country Star 3709. So as you can see, you have a sliding entry door. You can go ahead and put this down to unlock and then lock it back into place. But this provides a little bit of a barrier and some privacy for you as you take a nap or go to bed. As we move in here to the bedroom, you're gonna see your bedroom slide out button over here, so it can be in and out. You're gonna have your lights underneath, and then you're gonna have hanging wards on both the right and left hand side. So it's gonna be a tall ward with a hanging rod here, so if you wanna hang anything up. Right below, you're gonna again see that glass cabinet here. So this is gonna be your bedroom AV cabinet. So as we said previously in the living room above your televator, this is going to have your pre-wired HDMI cord. So again, if you want to hook a DVD player up or an Xbox, that provides ample signal to those. Right here, you're going to have a exit window here for your safety. And right above, you're going to have a 32 inch Samsung TV. Again, you're going to have that hanging uh, ward here with ample storage underneath with some drawers. You're gonna have that solid surface countertop. And again, with that full wall slide out, you're gonna have the carpet here in the bedroom. And then directly across from your dresser and your TV is gonna be your king-sized mattress. So your bed here is gonna come standard as a foam mattress, but what they chose to option in and what's featured here in this coach is gonna be our Sleep Number Air mattress. A ton of customers do choose to option that in, so just remember that when you're filling out your form. Above here, you're gonna have ample storage and cabinet space. So up top, you're gonna have two 110 volt outlets here. And then over here, you're going to be able, um, it's going to be a little bit hard to see because it's kind of flat here, but what you're going to have is a hole here that you can run wires through. And that's made for anyone that might have a CPAC machine or anything that just needs wires run down through here to sleep a little bit better and have a little bit of a easier access to those as well. And then what you're going to see here is going to be our Roca decor package throughout. Um, this is obviously going to be packaged up because it does ship down to our dealers and retail customers and we don't wanna take this out and get it dirty or damage it in any shape, way, or form. And then we're gonna go ahead and slowly work our way into the bathroom here. But before we do, I wanna go ahead and point out our ceiling feature here. So as I mentioned before, we have our Numar designer ceilings. So this is gonna be throughout any of our Numar brands. But what's cool about this is this is where our AC systems are gonna be located. So they're gonna be centrally located throughout the coach. 
And what that does is when our slides are in, that still provides you ample air throughout. So it doesn't have to come over the slides, it's just gonna come out through the central area. I'm making our way into the master bathroom here. You're gonna have another sliding entry door, so you can go ahead and open this up if you want to and have a little bit of privacy or it'll just lock back into place for you. Making our way into the bathroom here, I'm gonna go ahead and point out our ward over here to your right hand side. So it's again, gonna be an additional ward with a hanging rod and it's gonna have a light that comes on. Directly across, you're gonna have your shower. So you're gonna see a rounded door here. This is gonna unlock and lock with this little lever here. And it's gonna open up both ways. So it's gonna slide this way and it's gonna slide this way. I'll go ahead and step inside so everybody can kind of see how I rank within height wise into the shower. But you're gonna have your fiberglass shower floors and walls along with a removable shower head so you can move that off and use it. An assist handle. And then right above me, you're gonna see a really nice and pretty skylight. Um, so it just provides a little bit additional natural light into the shower. But along with that, if you are a little bit taller, it probably provides a good additional six to eight inches of head clearance for you. And then right over here, you're gonna have your vanity. So you're gonna have your solid surface countertops, which match your kitchen. You're gonna have your medicine cabinet. And you're gonna see a little bit of a carpet feel here, which kind of helps mitigate any collision that's also featured in your kitchen if you have dishes or anything like that. You're gonna have ample um, shelves up there. You're gonna have your lights underneath with um, two 110V outlets underneath with your stainless steel faucet. Again, you're gonna have cabinets below. You're gonna have the drawers to the side of me, which again will be the soft close, so it'll catch itself. And then over here, you're gonna have a optioned in washer and dryer. So this doesn't come standard. This would normally be a ward with washer and dryer prep but you can go ahead and option that in if you want. You're gonna have your commode, and then as you saw throughout the entire coach, you're gonna have that additional vinyl plank throughout. And then also featured in your master bath is gonna be your secondary egress door if you choose to option that in. This does not come standard with this Country Star 3709, but because it's here, I wanna go ahead and demonstrate how that's used. So it's gonna be currently in the lock position, so you need to unlock it here, and then you're also gonna to need to unlock it down below. So it's gonna have two locks. You're gonna have a handle and an assist handle, so it's gonna open up. That's gonna open all the way, and you're gonna have a magnetic cover down below. So this is gonna come off. You can just tuck it to the side of you. And then again, you're gonna see this extendable ladder. So you're gonna go ahead and unvelcro it. And basically, just drop it down. So that's gonna be a 300 pound weight limit, but you can go ahead and use that. And I'll go ahead and just show you how to get in and out of the coach. So you can go ahead and step on the toilet if you need to, otherwise you can just step around it, but make sure you grab onto the handle and you're just gonna slowly go out of the coach. So what's nice about our Numar doors here with our egress doors, whether it's standard or not, this is gonna be a reusable door. So most of our competitors actually have their doors come and they fall out. Um, some of them don't have ladders, so some of them you have to jump, but some of them also, We'll just have a ladder that's a one-time use and you're gonna have to get that replaced. Here at Newmar, whether you're using it for emergencies or if you're using it to load up the coach because you have people in the front, you know, it's 37 feet long, you might as well load whatever you need back here in from this way and whatever you need up front from that way. So it has multiple uses other than just emergency uses, but it's really nice and it's reusable here at Newmar. Thank you for coming along and exploring the Country Star 3709 with me for our 2022 model year. This coach is one of our most affordable diesels. It's one of our entry level diesel coaches here at Newmar. And it's perfect for anyone that currently is a gas motorhome owner, any families or couples, and anyone who thought maybe the diesels here at Newmar weren't super affordable. But this one is, and it doesn't take away from the luxury within this coach as you just saw outside and inside, which I love about it. And that's kind of why I want to end here on the fireplace because you can option that in and make it a little bit classier, step up from just what's standard here in the Country Star. Along with that, what you saw featured is gonna be our glacier glazed maple matte finish cabinets, our Roku decor, and then our Ashbury graphics on the outside. As always, I'm Megan Stouter, and if you have any questions about our Country Star 3709, give me a call here at Newmar Sales or call service. They'll answer any of your questions. Along with that, don't hesitate to contact one of our Newmar dealers across the country. They're there to help and make this process as enjoyable and fun as possible. I'm Megan, I'll see you next time.